Thank you so much for sticking to Y254 TV. My name is Cheryl Blessing, and this is the Power Talk Show. We were having a very interesting conversation on break. I will bring that up to Kiendelea. But I am here with Irene and Triple S. Conversation to Nahav Leoni, the social media effect. The pressure we get from social media, the perception we want to present, and nimeuliza swali, nimekuuliza social media. Can you fake it till you make it? Yondo kitu enye nataka kujua. Mnieleze, is it possible? U fake lifestyle yako alafu eventually, your lifestyle ikwe reality yako. Yondo nataka kujua, go on our platforms at Y254. Uniambie, can you actually fake it till you make it? So, yondo conversation inye tumekua nayo while we were on break. So let me sample some of the comments that you've shared. We have Mark Poldoski. This is from Facebook. Amesema sipo wakufik. Teseka TBD abini mungu na utafika hiyo stage mazi. Always show iko best. I'm tuned in from Chogi. Chuka Asanti sana. Rintoni Karema Kahoweni Chalani. Eh yo jina ako ni tang twister batina bamba. Natazama show nikiwa Chalani Kahoweni Asanti. Matthew Matthews Futsal Academy Kenya says be an individual. Work hard, study, get your mind straight, and trust nobody. Exactly. Hey, apoko trust nobody. Who I'm hurt I'm you? I'm <laughs> Who hurt you? Those <laughs> untalks are we watching from Runyenje's show, Iko Kuil, as Santi Sana. Then we have Matthews again, I'm uh, um, I quote, you got to find a way to survive because they win when your soul dies. And that's a quote from Amur, Amaru Shakur Makaveli Tupac. Nice. Uh, we have Rachel Jose who says, mm. yeah, if I can, check in. And um, we have Ian Tuwe who says, show ni poa na watch nikiwa LD, uliza our guest. How can one deal with peer pressure? That's what is killing us, the youth. Thank you. That's a very, very interesting question. We will definitely answer that. <coughs> Jackson Wamalwa, ako locked in from County 038 Vihiga. For sure, fake life is so expensive. If one can manage it well and good. Okay, interesting, for sure. Theory, new, theory Ruderi, K.E. amesema Ningori. <laughs> eh, period. John Tex Nyagaka Mama San amesema Wapi. <laughs> Augustine Rabbit amesema Shikumu, iko locked in Asanti. Raj, a.k.a. T-Boy, amesema Baya Sana. And we have Colin Squincy, amesema I, tricky. Asanti Sana. I like that tukona, like, moja wilo amesema it's possible, but wengine wanasema it's tricky. Yeah. And while we were on a break, we were having this conversation. Yeah. Irene. <laughs> Irene anatuambia, you, you see this... Uh, uh, delusion of oh, e, e concept and you're talking about, about manifesting so people tend to say when you're faking it it's like you're manifesting the life you want and there are people who have done it and it has come to pass in the international space in kenya and it, there are some examples of that but i read you don't you don't believe in manifesting you don't believe in that why do you feel like that's not a thing for you let me just go back my first point Social media shows you the end result or what they think you, they want you to see. They don't show you the actual thing. Yeah. They show you what they want you to see. So, yes, you can fake it and make it. That's very true. But it's, it never lasts. It either mm. it, it will take your soul or you lose the interest because you're, you're living a life that is not you. And at the end of the day, it catches up with you. Mm. And you find yourself struggling. That's why you find these big celebrities, Wamenda Rehab, all they're fighting, or sijua, whatever, whatever. Because at the end of the day, it has to catch up with you. Your soul is fighting with your heart and your brain. At the end of the day, it has to catch up with you. Mm, if you lose if it, one thing or yes, the other. It's either you, yes, you'll get, you'll get the money. Yes, you'll live a lavish lifestyle. That's what they're showing and that's what you're calling it. That's what you guys are calling making it. Yeah. But behind closed curtains, these people are fighting with their families. These people are not, are not okay. They are struggling in their sleep. They can't even sleep. They're always in rehab, taking meds. That is, that is not life. That's not, that's not how you're supposed to live life. You're not supposed to live life every day taking a pill. That's not yeah. how you're supposed to live life. And that's what this most people that you guys are saying, when we make it, that's how they're living it. Yeah. But there's the example, on the counter side, we were saying, <clears throat> there are examples of people who've actually become successful. And we've seen examples. And... Perhaps it's also the perception of social media. Perhaps exactly, it's what the we are perception seeing. of the social media. That's what they're showing you. But 
we have seen some success stories from that even from local content creators and stuff <sighs> the people who have seen at all kwanenda maybe wana wanafanya gikomba wa menunua designer brands ndio wa vibe wa feel ni kama wame make it yeah. then right now they have gotten to a place where they can actually afford to buy these clothes and this stuff in store so to them it's like they they got there slowly they envisioned that life and then they got there so triple s alikuwa anasema kuna some aspect enye he feels like it can happen and it's yeah. sustainable so tell us tell us about that yeah i think well this situation around by let me tell you i'm an artist now yeah. i do a lot of research because even me i want to make it that big and everyone want to make it that big hakuna mwenye anataka ateseke sana forever so you get that for me to get endorsements do you know do you know kampuni mingi sana au interact na triple s like au ni you personally but for them to endorse me like they want to give me their brand to be a brand ambassador they start with social media yeah so if they go to on my social media mm. they start with followers mm. and whatever i've been posting they start with pics what have i been posting e picture na post how many likes how many comments so after getting that niko na followers wengi or interact because juu yangu that's when they can give me that endorsement mm-hmm. just from nowhere yeah. Yeah. there's no need for me to make a good music iran street is when they take me that's true so unapata kitu kama hiyo unaweza pata mimi nime fake it kwa pale social media for me ni attract hizo likes na ma comments na nini for those people those company people wakuje wa kama na concentrate kwangu angalie they have to give me that deal mm-hmm. now once they give me that deal that's the end of it like i've gone with it niki make it evil sija fake eti alafu ni make ah yani sija sija fake alafu ni fail ni fake ni pate na nikipata na na nafanya kitu wise then naenda the same way how to record fanya loyalty test most of them kwa script but what gitu wanafanya na kama the pluto wanafanya big things unaona ali amejenga manja amefanya nini ako na big custom because ni kitu ali fake unaona Eh, mm. behind the curtains vile kwa sema anachao scribe anasema we active jifanye hivi mm. then alafu na capture attention na watu wengi mm. na that's how brand spread the viewers kamuona mm. zikampea this 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 mingi na doi kaingia because yeah. i fake it na kai make it mm. i don't yeah. i don't uh, i don't i'm not disagreeing with what he's saying i agree you can fake it and make it yeah. mm-hmm. my only point is i don't think to my personal opinion i don't feel like it lasts yes the money will might last uh-huh. But there's some aspects of you or as you as a person that you may lose in the process. That's what I'm talking about. I'm not talking about necessarily the money aspect or the financial aspect. Yes, you can fake it and make it. We've yeah. seen people do it a hundred times over. Yeah. But after the results, I feel like because it's something it's not something that you really worked hard for. Yeah. You're not going to value it. Mm. Cuz okay, I I understand. I feel mm. like I understand both yes, your points. Yes, I agree. Cuz there's there's some validity in both of it mm. the people who faked it and got it easy yeah. and the people who faked it and behind the scenes they were putting in so much work yeah. and yes. eventually ikajipa mm. yeah. so it's there's there's two sides to the story mm. yeah. and kuna mtu ametuuliza swali about dealing with social media pressure yeah. that comes with the faking it because there's that pressure of presenting your best yeah. when you nasema yeah. triple s kuna yo yo, yo nini ya Personally let me even bring it from the uh, perspective of the media. Yeah. There are people who are scouted from social media because they have numbers, because they have engagement. Mm. And there's someone who's gone to school, ako na qualifications but Instagram yake iko dead. Yeah. Yeah. So what we scout we are like who you atumchukui but who when you are like 100k followers and all that to tamchukua. Mm. So there's that aspect and people feel the pressure to present a certain lifestyle to compromise certain morals yeah. kuna kwanga na hiyo pressure ya social media uko like we sija post kwani mimi siendangi out yeah. kwani mimi sivangi vizuri yeah, kwani exactly. sina 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 form yeah. how do we deal with that how do we deal with the pressure irene how do you deal with the pressure as a business person mm. and as an individual to at the end of the day say hiyo ni life yake ini life yangu and i have to separate the two i learned fr- fr- from a very from a very early stage that you don't just consume everything and you don't do it, you don't you don't become a copy of someone else because the minute i start copying what you're doing i start wearing that dress that you're wearing i'm a copy of Cheryl. Yeah. i'm no longer irene so if i want to be irene 
I have to stick to what works for me. And at the end of the day, your instincts are going to tell you what, is, what works for you and what you should be doing. At the end of the day, God is going to guide us. God always guides you as a person, as an individual, what your purpose in life is. Yeah. So follow that. Mm -hmm. The minute you start following other people, the minute you start wanting to look like Sheryl or Triple X, mm -hmm. I'm a copy of Triple X, I'm no longer Irene. Mm -hmm. That's why I lose my authenticity. That's why I lose... In a quant, we are carbon copies of one person. So mm -hmm. don't talk about Kim Kardashian. <laughs> <laughs> mm. And there's only one Kim Kardashian. Yeah. There cannot there cannot be more than one Kim Kardashian. Mm. Yes. And you have to be authentic in exactly. who you are for you to get to destination yako kwa sababu kila mtu kuna journey yake. Na swali yenye tumekuwa tunauliza social media, swali yenye actively say I want you to go on our social media platforms unieleze can you fake it till you make it? Our socials are at y254. Niambie hata kama ni experience moja, can you actually fake it till you make it or do you think it's something that hufai kufanya, be authentic, be yourself, na itajipa. Go on our socials right now, alafu ntasapo uh, more comments to kiendelea. Na sasa triple S. Yeah. Wo umetuambia from the very beginning that you have to understand jani ya kila mtu ni hivyo kivyake yeah, and yeah. everything. Yeah. But you also mentioned sometimes yeah. the pressure, the comments, the people and the negativity can affect your mental health. Exactly. How do you deal with that? How do you ensure that as much as niko social media, mm. mimi ni content creator, mimi niko hapa putting out content, music, all this, yeah. I have to prioritize my mental health. Uh -huh. So, me, okay, me personally, me venya niko, I usually do whatever I think is right for me. So, me even if I post, then you abuse me. I'm like, I don't know you. Yeah. That's the first thing. Me, it's kujui, na to juani. You want us to argue. I don't know kama ulikula, na mi si ukula. We are two different people, nona. So, si ezi anza kuwagi na mtu sijui, na kile mtu waka life yake. Like, juzi ndi omtu alikuwa na niliza mbona WhatsApp status zangu. Sijai, hakuna sikuwa shayo angalia kaona ni post pombe. Whatever I can post ile fa sana ni chakula. Nikamambia bro, kila mtu wa post vitu zaka na fila anate kama na wafanya, izi na azina mpea afura. So, mi kama food ya nipea afura, hacha ni post food yangu, we post pombe yako. Siju kama download uka post, ama ilu kwa nakunyo uka post, kila mtu wa chiza la imi yake. So, mi sezi fanya kitu jumta nafanya. Iyo, iyo ni shase maga never. Mm. Then, whatever you think about me, I don't care. Yeah. Yeah. Because me, I feel like yo experience ni pata nikiwa, nikiwa prison, ni likuja yikani harden sana. Mm. I didn't kona, kuna vitu vingi ambao I should not engage myself with. No, no. Yeah. Yeah, hizo argument, I want to prove a point, just take me the way you take me. Unawana ile, 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 like, napita somewhere, then watu nasema, oh, ni kuna dreadlocks, uwe na vuta bangi, uwe ni muizi. It's okay, that's your opinion. Eh, hey, mini mvuta bangi, mini muizi. It's okay, I agree. Mm. Let me just go my way. Ifo tu, na siyezi judge mtu wamewa koti yeti ni pasta. That's you, the suit is okay. Just be you. Yeah. When you pass no abiri, ubiri, umesha ubiri, yes, how is okay. Here, mambo, it's your toa sadaka, or outa, outa na ufalima minguni, you are toa sadaka. None of my business, bro. Yeah. Eh, kama tutaenda, tutaenda wote. Jua, kuna mtu wata isha yaenda karudi, mm. akatuambia kukoje. Yeah. Akatuambia oo, alipata. Wengina umeka east side, wengina east side, matuluwa kitabu yako, ama movie yako, ulikuwa na misibiev, uwe rudi. <laughs> Hakuna. Mm. But nikitu watu wanafikiria tu. Kuna hell na kuna heaven, shetani sijua kwa huku. Eh, na ni goda kwa huku, so we unaenda hivi juu, we uliokoka, we unda, hakuna mtu wali jajua. But unambe wagu watu. Mm. Eh, so na na juu watu ume drop up with some interesting fact enye watu wata kwa like, nini ili happen. Eh. Now it's also reminded <laughs> me of the yeah. situation that got you there. Yeah. So I'll bring that back. Exactly. But Irene, how do you deal with... How do you detach do prioritize mental health yako ukiona maybe classmates wako because tuko kwa hii age yenye watu wako married sijui watu wako na watoto yeah. sijui wamenunua shamba nyumba wamejenga all those things yeah. how do you detach and say regardless of whatever is happening i have to prioritize my mental health and uchukue your social media break hata with what has been happening unajua in kenya since around June, there's been a lot. Una inge social media, una jam. <laughs> una una content, una jam. Uko yeah. like, ni nini sasa, ni nini huku. How do you prioritize your mental health to say me, eh, wata nitoke huku kiasi, ni, mimi mwenyewe ni kue sawa? Two things. It's never that serious, and I, I limit my time on social media as much as possible. Nikinge social media for my business, 
maybe to check what my friends and cl close friends are doing maybe relatives that's it yeah it's never that serious and limit as i've said the eyes are the doors to your soul limit what you consume limit the content you consume yeah only consume what works for you what will benefit you as a person yeah mm. and that also yeah. i think that also goes to the pages you follow the yes. things you watch all exactly. that exactly you have to be specific mm. yeah. if it makes you happy add that if mm. it inspires you add that kama unaiangalia una jam toka huko toka huko and triple s you've mentioned about your time in prison yeah. you were in prison some time back yeah. and you landed there because yeah. you were shooting a music video yeah ulikuwa kutumia fake money yeah. but how could you uh, you had to follow some protocols for you to use that exactly we see that with artists sana mtu ameka pesa mtu ame hire ma range rover sijuma ma bands nini that's the life of celebrities and all that exactly. so after your experience in prison did it mm -hmm. change the way you even shoot your videos did it change content yako when you put out there like that yeah exactly kila kitu ili change <coughs> even though i'm writing Unaanda hiyo the song I usually talk about your sad reality. Ile touch watch way watu wengi sana hadi wazazi hadi age siku anataka ni target sana unacheki. Yeah. Yeah, hadi unapata teenagers pia walikuja waka kwa nini na familia lazima na wale waka feel. Kuna kitu nimezungumzia nye niko poa. Mm. Una kama hiyo kuna part nasema eh ni, ndio nimefufuka nikaona wenye wamechimba kaburi sio wale marafiki zangu wa Nairobi. Sio wale watu wamevanga masuti na napiga nao sherehe na tutafuta nao madem wenye machimba kaburi langu ni walevi na walevi ni wale watu waocha wenye watu wakitoka Nairobi awapeange respect edhu mpeso so sijui walewe wamelewa na jina langu sawa wananisifu that's it not only that these people are too important because that the ones wata chukua jembe walime wa, wachimbe kaburi na washikile casket wakiingiza pale ndani ambao watu wako wa Nairobi ama watu wako wenye unaona wakubwa kubwa hawezi fanya Yeah. So they are very important in your life but always you are not checky. Mm. So that that's when I say kuna vitu zingine ambao zinafanyikanga yenye mtu hawezi fikiriaga. Though mimi na, na respect na tena na appreciate sana hiyo mm. kwenda prison. Kila kitu ile eh, happen for a reason. Eh, like ni Mungu wale nisukuma pale hivyo because vitu vingi ni kuja ni achieve baada ya kutoka prison ambao si kwa ina achieve. Mm. Singe za weka savings before in the prison. But after prison nilikuja nikajua day kama hii ina mean a lot in life of someone unaona yeah. so make good use of it na ujue at the end of the day ujue nini umefanya kuanzia asubuhi hadi jioni kila mtu ana 24 hours but it depends 24 hours yako umefanya nao nini mm. yeah, that what matters a lot in your life and that's very may very change. important kabisa because yeah. ultimately life ina happen yeah. in reality social exactly. media is just a fake si usema social media ni una hapo ni, ni content fake mara nyingi content yenye watu wanaweka ni juu ya brand ni juu ya perception ni juu wanataka ku create a certain image yeah. so how to finalize the conversation how can we separate reality mm -hmm. from social media how do we do we separate to seme ini life yangu na ini fake life ya social media because people tend to mix the two tunafika pali tuna confuse kama ini social media ama ini reality yeah. how do we separate reality from social media irene how do you separate that personally the two because umesema una ndango una consume content ya mabeshte mm. family unatoka yeah. una separate aje the two i just i just uh, know at the back of my head is i don't know these people they don't know me if i was to drop dead right now they wouldn't even know so i focus on people that matter the people who can impact my life yeah. those are the things i focus on mm. those are the things that nasema this person i'm jua either i'm jua personally or whatever or in business these are the people that matter to me that's what i consume that's what that's how i separate it yeah, mm. yeah. and i think that's that's what truly matters because understanding that life in a happen sai in this mm. moment, whatever we're doing right now it's this nice. is life yeah. the people watching us and all that together to post picha moja social media hiyo ni post inaenda yeah. but 
you in that moment when you nasema 24 hours within 24 hours that's when life happens yeah. so nilikuwa nimeuliza <coughs> nimeuliza rather swali of can you fake it till you make it and let me sample some of the last comments we have uh, from facebook we have ian r rotich amesema for me no i once tried but i ended up messing so you can't fake it till you make it according to ian rotich king t amesema as a master in this maze nimeficha life of social media imefanya niko so private watu hawezi ni judge na no one can stall me especially as a gen z tuko vulnerable kwa kupata pressure from other people so it's good to live a personal life with, without taking it uh, into account other people's social media influence nayo sipo Kayole iko locked in. Masi makena joy mark tuko hapa tuna watch big up paka musho. Show iko fiti. Asanti. I love that. Genyote iko hapo ina watch. We have Peter Scarlett amesema yes I can. Locked in show iko fiti. Asanti sana. Isaac Nalianya anasema na follow from Butere. We should live our normal life because the effect of faking can lead it can lead it hurting our mental health as we focus more on what others think than what our own lives are. At Beryl, I've been trying to DM you but I have not gotten any response. Mm -hmm. Hey, Isaac, come and shoot your shot half on <laughs> Beryl, we pati wa number. Um Karabati Gwiji Wakayela mesema Mwambaje <laughs> Asante, thank you so much. Uh, that's a, a wonderful, wonderful conversation we're having so far. So, let's get some parting shots. Kwa hi, triple S, wo umetuambia, it's so many words, umetuambia basically, wo unajoku separate social media yeah. na reality. Yeah. So, pati advice, mtu mwenye, a young artist, kijana oh. mdogo mwenye ako kwa mta, yeah. saa imi bino mmelza high school, ako ni fresha, nini, mm. ako social media na ako na pressure, anatika yeah. kufake life yake ndo watu wa mini ya meomoka. Mpati advice, what would you say to him? First of all, uswe kwa na pressure. Lazimu ujue nyumba yenu na nyumba jirani mko tafauti. Wala mekula nyama, nyi mga kula mboga. Mutalala nyi wate, kesho mutamuka nyi wate. The same. Kama, kama atatoka inja pate ni mchana, hupu atatoka inja pate ni mchana. People are different in so many ways. Your life, siyo life ya mwengine. Just follow your path. Mm. Wajua, kila mtu najua atakufa, lakini najua atakufa lini. Najui time atakufa, ni time gani, sindio? So the thing is usiai depend sana kwa lifestyle ya mse au unataka kuwa kama yeye. Kuwa tu like you want to work hard to achieve 1 to 3 yenye una desire because hakuna mtu wote anataka kuteseka in life. Yeah. Na shida ni una hizi hizi vidola zitoshani. So inakuwa mnagrow nyi wote lakini hamtaitoshana. Hakuna siku. Eh hata kama utakuwa chief au wenye nani alikuwa chief, maybe utakuwa na mali nyingi as a chief kuliko venye nani ile kwa chief akiwa na mali. Unaona? Mm. So in this life na semaga just follow your path. Don't do something because someone an, an, anafanya. Yeah. You don't know kwa nini anaifanya. Mm. So don't be influenced to fanya. Useme acha nifanye hivi kwa sababu nani anafanya hivi ndio amefika pale. Kuna kitu uliongelea ukasema watu wengi wamesoma apate hiyo fulani lakini apewi na kuna hizo qualifications. Yeye tunapata someone ka, wengine kama ma comedians wanachukua wanapewa opportunity. So, una, unataka kuniambia watu kama hawa walikuwa walikuwa na compete kweli. So, si, eh usiye compare yourself with someone. Kila mtu alikuwa na njia yake, yule alikuwa na comedy na yule alikuwa anasomea hii nini. Huyu hata mtu wa comedy mimi ile ya class 7 au ile ya high school na huyu ameenda university hadi aka graduate but anapata job ajapewa wamepea huyu jamaa wa mm. comedy. Kila mtu ako na path yake. Yeah, just do your thing na uombe Mungu weke Mungu mbele utafika tu place unataka. Mm, that's yeah, really, really nice. I really yeah. love that. Irene, what about you? Talk to our ladies when you wanna engage social media, when you wanna Range Rover, you make a ribbon when I shindo a god win. But they don't know behind the scenes what's going on. What will you tell them? How to maintain themselves, their authenticity, and separating their reality from social media now seeing you qua pressure. There's this quote I like using. It's never that serious. It's never that serious. And we are, we all matter. In every small way, when you say my but they are all equally important. You can't do without the pinky. You can't do without the pa without the thumb. So it's never that serious. You can get social media on a beshtaka menlu agari. 
congratulate them. Say, hey, that car looks nice. And then, oh, Narudu, unenda kazi yako. Unenda yeah. ufanya kazi yako. Yeah. And that, just know that you are equally important as you mtu mwenye aminuliwa gari. So, yeah. not that serious. And we all matter. Two things. Thank you. <laughs> and let me just quickly mention your social media platforms. Kwa sabu, na doni kiwa patia. Chance. <laughs> <laughs> overrun. Triple S. Yeah. You go by Triple S uh, across. Triple S Kenya. Yeah. Yeah. Triple S double P. Mm. Uh, Umfuate Triple S. Kenya. Double P. Kenya yeah. on social media. Yeah. And we have Be It Sense. Be It Period Sense. Mm. Yeah. So follow our wonderful, wonderful <laughs> guests. Work on our content. Work on our products. What support. And come back next week. Uh, this is time because Mnajwa time you to Isha Isha. Lakini yeah. we'll have a repeat of this tomorrow between 1 and 2 p.m. And we will also put it up on YouTube. So come back next week. We'll have another interesting conversation. If you've taken away anything from this conversation, it's be authentic. Social media is just that. Social media. Live your life. Do not feel like you have pressure to do anything. Everyone has their own journey. So accept that and everything else is going to work out for you. That's it for us for today. I'd like to thank the entire team. It's been a wonderful, wonderful show. And thank you once again for tuning in. That's it. My name is Cheryl Blessing and I'll catch you guys next time.